this is Josh from Advanced Camping, bringing you another video tour. This one of a brand spanking new 2024 Pleasureway Plateau XLTS. Uh, these are absolutely beautiful machines, um, just totally luxurious from start to finish. Uh, they are extremely well built. Fun way, everything is handcrafted, handmade, all made from the best materials. Um, you know, I did a little bit of looking into it, and uh, you know, insulation wise, they're using 3M Finsulet insulation. You're talking, um, you know, birchwood uh, boxes for the insides of the uh, cabinets. So, everything from start to finish is just absolutely gorgeous so on the outside here we're going to have frameless windows and uh, we have 500 watts of solar on the roof that is a ton of solar panels uh, and you have the 600 amp hours of lithium ion batteries on board so that's going to give you a ton of air conditioner runtime it's got the brand new air conditioner on board too that's whisper quiet and is uh, more efficient with battery and energy usage. Uh, this one is ordered with a full body paint, the Alcoa aluminum wheels, the 500 watts of solar, which we just talked about. Uh, it has a big, nice big uh, power awning here and that will have a wind sensor on board. It is a lighted power awning as well, uh, very slick. There's going to still be a backup generator on board, too, and that's an inverter generator. So very, very quiet uh, onboard generator. So when eventually your batteries run out, uh, that will automatically kick on, and uh, you'll have unlimited power as long as you want to stay. So that is really, really cool. Um, and there's going to be a gas grill hookup here if you want to hook up your own grill and grill underneath the awning. We're gonna have some outside outlets here. Uh, we'll have little storage areas. Oop, this one's locked um, all throughout. And uh, let's see, it's got the new Mercedes chassis with a new four cylinder that actually has more torque and more horsepower than last year's and has considerably better mileage. So that's fantastic. It also has on the Mercedes chassis, the rear view camera mirror. So that is on all the time. It is your rear view mirror. So you have no blind spots. It's showing you everything in a wide angle view behind you. Um, it's an incredibly useful tool that once you start using that or you get a vehicle with that, it's impossible to go without it. It really is fantastic, especially for motorhomes, uh, as you will have blind spots otherwise, of course. Then there is a backup camera naturally, and uh, we'll have a towing for 5,000 pounds. There's going to be hooks there for uh, your brake controller and trailer wiring. It's going to have your instant tankless water heater. And what's nice about that is there's a recirculating 12 volt pump that is going to give you hot water at each one of the taps, even the outside shower here immediately. So what that means is you don't have to run the water for, you know, just like at home where you have to run the water uh, until it turns hot. You don't have to do that here. It's gonna be hot right away, which is gonna save your gray water tanks, your fresh water tanks. Um, so maximizing efficiency really. So we'll have a little bit of extra storage underneath here. Just little bits of storage kind of all throughout. Real heavy duty, thick doors here too, which I absolutely love. Real thick, heavy duty latches and locks here. Um, everything really just feels, just from the accents and everything, just feels really, really well built and really solid. Um, so yeah, it just looks just fantastic, uh, especially in person. There's some sort of intangibility about it, but everything feels just really tight, well-made, uh, and classy looking, really. It just looks classy looking from the exterior here to uh, the gorgeous interior. So we'll have a utility center that'll uh, have all of our hookups for electrical, water, and such. Uh, we're all venting from our furnace here. Uh, we'll have some drainage for the black and gray water tanks. And this is our new Mercedes chassis. It's going to be a cutaway chassis, of course. This, this is a B plus, if you will. 
but uh, yeah, it has all your favorite features, adaptive cruise control. Um, you know, it's going to have those cameras we were telling you about. Uh, it's going to have uh, power heated seats. And what's nice is these seats will swivel around and uh, you can actually utilize these front seats real well. Uh, you can see they actually put uh, the uh, lagoon table leg there. So you can have the lagoon table there. There's going to be some outlets over there as well for the driver. Passenger has this little uh, stand here for devices, you know, iPads, um, you know, phones, whatever you want. And then there's going to be hookups here uh, on the Corian countertop, which is nice. Let's take a look inside here. Our, this thing is absolutely gorgeous. Um, some of which you can see on film, some of which you just have to see, feel, and smell. Um, it just just looks absolutely gorgeous, all finished together here. Even the walls here, I don't know if you can see it, uh, but it's actually Corian walls, uh, as well as the countertops all throughout. You know, you're going to have some accent lighting all throughout really just kind of adds to the vibe. And then there's going to be accent lighting in the shower with a Corian uh, backdrop. Just looks really, really uh, spectacular. So, I mean, even just going up to the top above the door here, you know, they could have easily just left this alone, but they put a nice little pantry or spice rack or whatever you want to do with that. Uh, they give you all kinds of little bits of storage. Even in front here, I was quite surprised when I opened this front door up to see the amount of storage up in here. I mean, you could put suitcases up in here. Uh, it is huge. So you have uh, great storage there all throughout. All looks beautiful. And I, I always like, I always mention this, Pleasure Way actually pads all the areas in which one can hit their head. Uh, me being a taller guy, I do appreciate that sort of a thing. So I like that too. You know, they're gonna they're thinking of all the sort of little things uh, that could come up. This bathroom is second to none, as far as I am concerned. It is absolutely gorgeous. So we have a backlit uh, Corian counter or Corian backdrop, I should say, not countertop. Uh, looks absolutely spectacular uh, with that stainless steel finish. I mean, just looks super, super high-end, luxurious, um, just wonderful in here. Then you're going to have some more uh, Corian backdrop here. So that kind of reflects. I don't know if you can see that, but you, you can see that in person. So it kind of reflects off the Corian and just gives a very modern, really high-end feel to it. Absolutely. We'll have a stainless steel sink here, all kinds of good storage throughout for toiletries, anything you may need. Uh, of course, the high-rise toilet there, which will be porcelain bowl, always nice. And then some more storage up on top here too, uh, for maybe towels, things like that. Larger items, perhaps. Okay. And yeah, it all looks very nice with the nice wood grain. It's nice and bright, open, airy in here. Um, you know, and then they add a nice mirror just uh, to give you some viewing when you're getting ready in the morning. And you have your induction cooktop here. And we'll have all slow close drawers all throughout here. This is that Baltic birch wood I was telling you about. Not Mediterranean birch wood. No way. We're talking Baltic birch wood. <laughs> Only the best. Um, but it is actually very beautiful. It actually smells really nice. The slow closed drawers. I mean, everything fits just the way it should. Um, you know, that's there's just a lot of intangibles in here. I wish I could just show it to you on video, but it really is spectacular. From you know, and I do I, I do a lot of these videos. I see a lot of these. Uh, this one really is spectacular. Uh, we have a nice stainless steel uh, front for a big refrigerator and freezer combo here. This freezer can actually be removed if you just want total refrigerator space, but nice big refrigerator and freezer combo and uh, fits nicely. So you can still have your hanging wardrobe right next to it. Quite nice, real deep too. Um, so there's plenty of room to store really any kind of clothing you want in there. 
And then that also houses uh, some of the controls for the TV antenna. It's going to have the uh, Razer WineGuard system, which is the best TV antenna on the market. It's going to sort of circulate in a you know, plastic dome on top to really optimize uh, and get you the best channels throughout. So yeah, you're gonna have three touch screens throughout, one in the bathroom, uh, one by the door, and then one back here in the lounge and sleeping area. And so yeah, this will control all your, you know, climate control. You can uh, turn the inverter on for using 110 power. If you wanna do that, you can really do everything. You can dim certain lighting zones if you'd like, uh, have that generator automatically turn on when the you know, batteries run low or not, totally up to you. And there's memory foam, again, back here, and uh, it uses ultra leather, so it's super soft, breathable, doesn't get sticky in the heat, uh, so a very comfortable material. You will not need a mattress topper for this. I am a mattress snob myself. Um, you know, I've got, you know, nothing but the best. I got back problems. This is really, really comfortable. So uh, you're going to love that. Uh, so again, you're not going to need to, you know, bring a whole nother mattress topper with you just to sleep on it. So we have our Bose soundbar, our LG 24-inch uh, smart TV on a big swivel mount there. So you can hook up all your Wi-Fi uh, hotspots to that and stream all of your favorite uh, streaming services right on there. If you decide to bring an Apple TV or Fire Stick or whatever you want to bring, you can do that too. Uh, all that's very simple. And yeah, they give you nice, uh, you know, little storage ledges along the side here with power outlets. So, um, you know, they're really kind of thinking of, of everything here, everything you could possibly use this for. And I'm just kind of showing you some of the additional um, windows here. And again, with these frameless windows, what I like is these actually awning out. Uh, so instead of just sliding open um, with these awning style windows, with the frameless windows, not only do they look nicer on the outside, but um, you know they give you the ability to have these open even in the rain. And it does have sort of panning around here you can see that up on top there it's got that uh fantastic fan now it's probably a max air fan or whatever but um they all do the same thing so you're going to have a rain sensor on board so if it starts raining it'll close itself up automatically but that moves a ton of air throughout here most of my customers will tell me that they hardly ever need to run the air conditioner as those are so effective that uh, they just don't need to very often. Of course, it is nice to have it. And this does have the upgraded uh, Truma air conditioner that is whisper quiet and a lot more energy efficient. Uh, we mentioned that just a little bit earlier, but it's nice to touch on again, as that's a nice upgrade. Uh, so yeah, I mean, we're talking, you know, everything from, you know, the engine being a totally different engine, to the power system in here being a 600 amp hour uh, lithium battery system with a very whisper quiet generator as a backup to run as long as you want. Um, 500 watts of solar, you could be anywhere you want and never even have to think about plugging in. You can expect much better uh, miles per gallon. It's a little early. I don't know exactly what this is gonna get miles per gallon wise. Just being totally honest with you, the previous, the six cylinders would get 18 to 22. We've been hearing from some of our customers who've had these. They're averaging 26 to 28 on something, uh, a cutaway chassis like this uh, with a little bit more weight on it. Tough to say. I would probably say you're probably going to get somewhere around 25 to 26 miles to the gallon would be my best guesstimate, which is still considerably better uh, than the six cylinders they had previously. And you have more horsepower again and uh, more torque. So you have all the capabilities you used to have and then some and better mileage. So this will be our Mercedes chassis. Again, that rear view mirror uh, is actually a camera that is on all the time. And again, um, I can't state enough how valuable that, that really is. Uh, it does of course have the backup camera system, um, which is super helpful of course when you're backing up. And, you know, when you move the wheel, it uh, changes the lines and you can really line up nice and easy and park easy. 
but for actually driving down the road, uh, having that wide angle view always on all the time is very helpful. So yeah, and it has all the things you'd really expect on a Mercedes chassis, uh, adaptive cruise, active lane keeping assist, power heated seats with um, memory functions. So you're really going to kind of have the best of both worlds. And now you have the five-year warranty on the Mercedes and the five-year warranty on the Pleasure Way. So it is by far, it has by far the most uh, warranty on it of any motorhome out there. As you have five years on the chassis, five years on the coach. Uh, there's just nothing else like that in the entire industry. Uh, the industry standard really is kind of one year for the coach portion anyway, one or two years. So, you know, Pleasure Way is really saying, hey, this is really well built. Um, you know, we're confident in it. So we're going to warranty it for much longer than everybody else. So uh, I think that says a lot about their build quality. And uh, it's just absolutely fantastic. It is you can tell someone loved this thing. I mean, honest to God, uh, you can really tell just from all the finishing details. Uh, someone really uh, took the time to get every last little detail. I mean, even just you just can't find any faults with it throughout. Um, even on the smallest little corners, you cannot find anything wrong with it. It is just a beautiful, beautiful coach. Well put together, well loved. There are not many of these that are going to be built, uh, so it's going to be sort of a finite number. It takes them, um, I believe they said something like two or three times as long to build one of these as opposed to one of their B-Vans. So, I mean, there's just not going to be as many of these out there as there will be, you know, Pleasure Ways B-Vans. So, um, get them while they're hot as, uh, you know, there's not going to be that many of them made for sure. Um, so this is an absolute beauty. This is a 2024 XLTS from Pleasure Way. I'm Josh. Please do feel free to ask for me if you would be so kind. And the number is 414-281-6330. Uh, check this out at our website at advancedcamping.com. And of course, if you like this video and want to see more, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you and have a great day.